Today is the day of my laser eye surgery and I am a little bit nervous, I have to admit. I'm not allowed to wear any makeup, even though um, I've had my eyebrows tattooed so they won't be able to come off. I've got spots everywhere, I have dark circles, we've been up all night with our son, uh, he's nine months old, been teething very badly, might I add. My appointment's at four o'clock this afternoon, so I'm just trying to kill some time at home. I'll see you on the other side in a few hours, so, oh god, here we go, laser eye surgery day, awful spots, see you on the other side. So I've just got home from having my laser eye surgery and I can see it's really crazy. Your eyes are streaming. Yeah, I know. I went into the clinic. I was called into one of the rooms. I had my eyesight checked again just to make sure that it hadn't changed um, and just to reconfirm what my prescription was as it was last checked quite a while ago. I got to meet the surgeon and he was really friendly. Um, he told me about everything that would happen. It was all explained to me step by step. And then I was shown the medication, which is all down here. And I signed some paperwork. I filled out a questionnaire. Then I was called into the surgery room. I had to go through a door um, with a kind of sticky mat that you walk your feet on. You put a hair net on, a kind of disinfectant thing, and you cover your feet. I was then laid on a bed in the operating theatre. Is it operating or laser theatre? Three people in the room. It was a bit disorientating. There were big machines everywhere and it was quite bright. I laid down on the bed and I was told to stay really calm. My heart was going, I was panicking, I thought it would hurt. I was really kind of tense but I did my best to not move. I had one eye covered with a bandage. The machine came across. I had to look up into a ring of light. It felt like a clamp put into my eye as I had to look down, look up and then there was a screwing sensation. Everything went kind of blurry a little bit, I had various drops put in. It was like a really cold water, a kind of suction thing. And all the way through, the ladies in the background were counting down numbers and saying 20%, 10%, five seconds left. And I kind of hung on to everything they said and counted it down with them. It didn't hurt at all, you, you couldn't feel anything. If there was a slight pressure, of the suction and you just see lights kind of blurring in, in and out it's a bit like being on a fairground ride when it's dark it kind of takes away your senses but you're with it and you understand what's going on i just concentrated on staying dead still and looking straight up at the light the second machine came along which was the laser so they switched between both eyes with the bandages and the kind of suction which as far as I realise is it takes a flap of the front of your eye off. The laser, you just look into a, a series of red lights and you hear a clicky pinging sound. It's like tick, 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 tick. You smell a slight sense of burning. It's not anything scary. They count down, I think it was 20 seconds or 15 seconds and then it was done. And the surgeon then kind of poked something towards my eye from what I could see. Everything was very unfocused and blurry. And I think he was replacing the front of my eye. And then he did the other eye. And then that was it. I was told to close my eyes and sit in a room next door for about five or 10 minutes. And I had dark glasses on, as I'm wearing now. And my eyes have since started watering. I sat in the room for a few minutes and kind of I tried to find myself again. I was a bit disorientated and couldn't concentrate on many things. I then went into the consultation room and had my eyes checked again with the surgeon that had just performed it came and had a look and he said that everything was fine and I was happy to go home and I've been wearing my glasses since. It was a little bit strange feeling kind of not blinded but you didn't want to open your eyes because it, it felt as if I had shampoo put in them. So I kind of wanted to keep my eyes shut and, and keep the glasses on and I was very sensitive to light. I could see with my eyes shut and the glasses on if the light was on in a, in a room. I've been home and my eyes are watering. There's no pain, there's no discomfort. It's just as if I've had my eyes washed. I'm going to take my glasses off to show you what they look like. Um, I have no idea what they look like, I actually haven't seen them in the mirror yet, but I have to administer eye drops now, um, some for pain relief and some to keep them moist. I have to wear shields at night when I sleep. 
But the weirdest thing, even though it's only been a matter of hours, I think maybe two hours since I had the surgery, I can actually see things sharp. I can see the edge of pages, which I've never seen for years. It's, it's absolutely amazing. And it's a clarity of vision that I've never had in my life. And it isn't even completely healed yet, which is the craziest thing. Um, normally my eyesight would have been blurry and soft around the edges, but everything that I see now is just so sharp and straight. It's as if someone's put a ruler to the whole world. So now I'm going to have my eye drops and um, I'm, I'm just amazed at what's been achieved. And I'm so happy. It's the best thing I've ever done. Uh, this is the pain killer. Mm -hmm. oh, it's lovely. Okay, hold on. Let me just get out of it. It hit, it hit. Did it get in? Yeah, it's like you saw my battleship. <laughs> oh. Yep, those are the painkillers. Ooh, attractive. We now have the Exosyn, which is 10 minutes later, and. Do you need a your chest? <laughs> and I think it's a lubricant. I'm not 100% sure, but we've got a whole list of the things to put into my eyes, which is quite fun. So here we go one drop in each eye. My eyes aren't all straight anymore, are they? The money shop. Lovely. Now we just have to do FML, which is a nicely named one, in what's that another ten minutes? Yeah. Yeah, um, and that's all of it. And then we wear refresh uh, refresh drops in between. I can see. Perfect. Yeah, that's cool. Can you actually see the damage on my eye now? Can you get closer to it? Turn your eye a little bit. Yeah. The other way. Yeah, you can see like where it's lasered line. Can you? Up and down. No, oh, that was better. There you go. Does it look painful? No. It's 10 o'clock, I had it done at 6, half 6, and I can see everything. Everything is so clear and sharp. It, it's as if I've just woken up for the first time. It's absolutely amazing. I can't, I can't wait for tomorrow for to tell me how strong my eyesight is and brilliant. FML drops which are the anti-inflammatory ones. So it's one in each eye. The eyes are a little bit swollen. They are, your eyelids are stronger. Yeah, they said it would. Oh, if I had eyeliner on, I wouldn't look like a puffy pig right now. So we wait another quarter of an hour and then we put our refresh drops on and then I can shield my face for bed. Yay! I can't wait. This is refresh and it's the lubricant that you put in your eyes to stop your flaps from getting stuck or something like that. You get only two drops in each eye. Oh. Now I'm going to go to bed because it's almost 11 o'clock at night and I'm really tired. My eyes are starting to get a little bit swollen, but they're not sore. Uh, I have to put my shields on, so here we go, we're going to put some nice eyewear. I can actually taste the drops running down the back of my throat. Mm. Oh, yeah, why would you do that? I don't know. It's a bit cruel. <laughs> Have you worn this for a week? Um, can I just put a bit more on the other one? Because I didn't put some Not much tape on it.